Okay, we have some drumming. This is our OBT mating attempt number one, part one, I guess. We have a lot of OBTs, so we'll make a lot of mating videos over time. Right now, I have two females ready, and they've been they were sitting there about ten minutes, and they weren't doing anything, but now they're drumming. We'll see. You hear that? They're holding hands. You can see how much bigger she is than him. He's trying to lure her out. I think that's kind of the more natural thing for a male to come to a, a female's place and lure her out to where he feels safe and that way he can run away. We got our ruler here to just in case. If she if she tried nail on him now, I might not be able to get him. But there we go. See if he gets that in. She locked up her fangs. Oh, I think he got an insertion right there. That's maybe good. My uh, I had a mature male who made it with my other female and I sent him on to someone else and he's been apparently pretty good so if that my first mating with my other female was successful we could have an egg sack any time and they locked up four times so they may not be done there's one fang you gotta get that other one well, he's not even worried about that there's trust Okay, there's both fangs. Push her up. Got my miniature helper coming to help me. I can hear her. There we go. Insertion. I'm not sure if the camera saw that, but I saw it from my angle slightly different. She is a lot bigger than him. But we had a mature male OBT that was like two-thirds the size of this guy. He was so small. There you go. We're just chillaxing now. Let's see if we can get a closer view. There we are about six inches away. OBTs are one of the only spiders I've seen that they grab things or they mate and they, they end up on their back just relaxing or whatever. I'm not sure. 
they are quite acrobatic. One of my OBT males at one point jumped at least 12 inches, about 6 feet up from a container to a wall before I could put the lid on. That was interesting. Can't tell if he's got insertions down in there. Maybe. Pretty cool. Not sure if we're going to run out of memory or battery here pretty soon, but... Hey, Andy. That was the library. Good. What are you doing, Dad? Spiders. Making babies. Maybe. At least they're kissing. I think that's how spiders kiss, if spiders kiss. Oh. The mom is shaking. Or the dad. I haven't seen him lock up that long before. I wonder. They're pretty interesting looking. Yeah. If it jumps on your face, don't don't kill it, okay? Okay. I'm just kidding. I should have let Bishop Anderson see this. You can show the video to him. Yeah, show him the video. There you go. That's why I have kids, because they're smarter than me. You can see down there, they're just hanging. No, uh... No monkey business. Alright, well, check out spiderguy.net or spiderguytv on YouTube. And, uh, Wait, just, are those the names? That's where you'll find the videos that we're making. And, um, yeah, maybe we'll have some OBTs for sale here soon. I'll keep you updated. If, they, if this was a successful mating, it would take 30 to 45 days, maybe 50 or 60, to get an egg sack. And then uh, we'll see. I'm hoping that this will give us multiple egg sacks, because OBTs are one of the only ones that if they mate, they'll have, they'll have an egg sack, and then they can have another one, and then another one. And they also can carry sperm over through a molt, I believe. And most spiders don't do that. So, so there you go. I think he's trying to back up right now. Oh, no, maybe he's going in again. I think that was successful right there again. Oh, we have the escape. Here is the ruler. If I, was, if I touch them with this ruler, they're both going to explode just like pew, pew. So, be careful. We don't want her to start thinking she needs food for those future babies. Alright. Okay. Enjoy. That is it.